hello welcome to my kitchen today I have a very simple and delicious recipe um, for shishito peppers which is these delicious tasty peppers they're not spicy you can eat them just like that you can serve as an appetizer two or three this is such a fast recipe basically all you need is some kosher salt I'm using a little cayenne pepper and I'm yeah a little cayenne pepper and also, um, what I do, I'm going to do is I'm going to wash them. And then in a pan, which I have ready, I, I'm going to put a little bit of um, vegetable oil and get it really hot. And when it's really hot, you're just basically going to saute this for about a minute to three. You want it to just get a little brown. Once that happens, you put them on a paper towel, then on a plate, and then you sprinkle some sea salt, some cayenne pepper, and you just enjoy. So simple, so yummy. Great, so your pan should be very hot. I want you to also be careful because the oil might jump up at you. So just be careful. So here I have my shishito peppers. They're washed and very well dried. So you just saute them. Remember about a minute to three. See that? And these are so yummy. They're just a bit of salt. You can have a whole bunch of them. Another thing for these is you could also make a really yummy... Um, batter and you could um, put these in the batter and fry them up and yum you see so one side is already starting to turn a little dark you turn them around you see that you see that little browning starting this is really fast I like these to be fancy as an appetizer like if I'm having a little party and I want like something quick and tasty and fancy shishito peppers and also they have to be in season, you know. I got these from Fresh Direct. You know I love Fresh Direct. So look, this one is almost done. You see that little browning? You don't want to burn them, so you stay right on top of them. You can also deep fry these. If now, if you do deep fry them, you know it's a minute or less. Because you don't want to burn them. We're almost there. You can see the skin is getting a little dark on one side. Oh, you can look at this one. This side is totally done. Yummy. Oh, this smells so good. That peppery smell that's coming out. And that's that I have a little bit of allergies, but I can still smell how yummy they are. Alright, a few more turns. And I'm ready. Yum. So it's been about a minute and a half. One more turn on a few of them. And I am ready because I don't want to burn them. This with tofu, with um, even with shrimp on the side, or with the battered ones. Oh, so, I just like because I'm about to just have these, just like that to pick on. All right, my peppers are ready. So I have a plate ready right here. Just be careful; the oil jumps up at you. Why you should get burned, especially if you deep fry them. Yummy, look at them. See that little browning right there? Yummy. So you drain them for about a couple seconds. Then I drain them up a bit. Great. Oh, they're so yummy. They smell so good. They kind of smell like popcorn. <laughs> okay. So there, I've drained them. I'm going to plate them. So basically all you do, a little kosher salt. A little cayenne pepper. And those are shishito peppers. Really fast recipe, so tasty, so delicious. You are going to love these little peppers. Look at that. Yummy. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Oh, yummy. Yummy. With that little bit of salt and that little bit of heat. That's all that's left. So tasty. So I hope you enjoyed this fast recipe. 
for shishito peppers. If you can get some, and, or and you've maybe never had them, give them a try. They're a dish that you could prepare really easy. So, there's so much flavor in them, I think. They're really tasty. I love peppers myself, so this little dish is just jum yummy. And um, the other way I told you is putting them in a batter. If you want that recipe of the batter, just email me and I'll send it to you. And um, I hope you enjoyed this quick video and I hope everybody's having a great November. Okay, starting to be cold, just warm up. And everybody out there, thank you so much for watching my videos, leaving comments. I enjoy it so much. Um, it's really fun that people like my recipes and actually try them out. And um, just keep having a good time out there and be safe. Okay, take care and thank you so much.